is round three, and our experts are going to answer two questions, this time for a whopping $5 a piece. And while they're thinking about their answers, their opponents are going to bet on whether they know it or not. If their opponent guesses right, their opponent makes just as much money as the expert who's answering. We're going to start with you, Eric. The category is Spice Girls. Eric, what two songs did the Spice Girls sing on their 1997 Saturday Night Live appearance? Interesting. They're, they're looking at mm. you and wondering whether or not you know. Michael Rooney gave a glance mm. trying to get a little... Okay, uh, Wanna Be and Say You'll Be There? Wanna Be and Say You'll Be There are correct answers. Let's see, what do you guys say? Michael said you'd get it wrong. Will said you'd get it right. Eric and Will get some money. We come now to you, Will. Um, the category is Billy Joel. I ask you this. What three foreign cities are in the titles of songs from Billy Joel's studio albums? Is Allentown a foreign city? <laughs> it is. It depends on where you're from. To some, yeah. Yeah. And uh, Will, do you have your answer? Uh, Leningrad. Vienna. And Miami's not a foreign city. Havana. Havana's not it. When in Rome is right. Michael? I, I can do right. nothing. Eric thought you get a lot of faith in you, Will. Back to the Lord of the Rings here. Uh, Michael, what type of creature is each of these characters? Celeborn, Azog, and Bregolod. Okay. It's Celeborn, I believe. I believe it's Celeborn. Did yes, I say yes. Celeborn? I, I, yes. It, yeah, it's, it's okay. Yeah. I believe Celeborn is a prescription medicine. <laughs> That's right. I tried that. <laughs> right. So I don't want to get it. We don't have time to get into the side of it. All right. Uh, <laughs> do we, uh, uh, gentlemen, are you in with your guesses? Yeah. And the answer? Okay. Uh, could you repeat those three again? Celeborn. He's an elf. Azog. He is an orc or a goblin. And Bregolet. Uh, Bregolod is a human being. He's an ant. Oh. An ant. He got it wrong, Will. Thought he'd, he'd get, get it, right. it right. Eric thought he'd get he it, right. get it right. Look too. at that. How <laughs> ye of so much faith. Uh, we come back now to you, Eric. Okay. It's a close game. Money to be made right here. What fictional band, based on the Spice Girls, did Jack in the Box create to promote one of their new sandwiches? This is a Spice Girls question. Michael, Will, they're ready. Eric? Something with spicy chicken, but I can't. Nope. You don't have an answer. It's nah. the spicy, crispy chicks. The spicy, crispy chicks. Sounds so, Michael and Will, let's see. No. Michael thought you'd get it right. $5 to Will. There we go. We have a little money going out. And we come back okay. to you, Will. In 2011. Billy Joel's portrait was hung in the showroom of what Manhattan business, becoming the first non-classical pianist so honored? Think while these guys try and figure if you know it. It's not the executive room, is it? It's not the executive room. <laughs> we wouldn't do that to him. It's the executive lounge. Oh, it's yeah. Come on. <laughs> Everyone knows that except me. <laughs> well, what is this business in Manhattan? That was the Steinway Piano That company. is correct. Michael? I'll find so you get it right. Oh. Eric thought you get it wrong. Five dollars for Will and Michael. And we come back to you, Michael, for the final question of the round in the category of the books, The Lord of the Rings. What plant does Aragorn use to ease Frodo's pain after he is stabbed at Weathertop? Will and Eric kind of sussing out the situation. Hmm. Michael trying to make five while they make none. And here we go, Michael. What is that plant? King's foil? King's foil's right. $5 for you, $5 for Eric, and $5 for Will. <laughs> we will be back with our yes. expert of experts round, round four here on the experts.